Yeah, really stupid idea. Really, really stupid idea. Hey guys, it's Tyson. And today we're gonna start off with a brand new arc. We're running this in single player, just me, because I was bored at the time. So I'm gonna start out a new map and we're just gonna see how far we get before we get tired of doing this and go back onto the big servers or off on our own again, onto some other game. So I'm gonna start out a new character here, brand new, and Lord Tyson. Yes, I know it's spelled funny, but that's how I pronounce it. And we're gonna make ourselves, let's go with a nice bright red. Right there. Hair color, what do we want? Um, white, because it's creepy like that. And... We have a big head. Yes, we have a big head. Nah, ha, ha. nah. Give him some decent sized brows there. Ah, ha, ha. Huge chin. No, I'm just kidding. That's just ugly as hell. Eh, looks like Mr. Bean. Eh, we're gonna up his size anyway. Head size, pretty decent. Pretty good size. Head depth, why not? Because he's got a big head. And... Gigantic arms. Really long arms. Heh. <laughs> Should make that. Nah. It looks kinda creepy. And a little bit too big. Welcome to the gun show. I'll be back. Okay, I'm done doing that. Eh, give him some decent sized steps there. I don't want to look like a Hulk. Up that, make him decently tall. And we don't... God, he's not even female, but he's got moobs. Eh. Shoulders to fit those arms a little better. There we go, that kind of fits the body. Go, the height of the torso. Eh, let's make him like two feet tall. There we go. Make him a freaking midget. just obscenely tiny in the legs. So why not? Ah, who are we getting? Let's just make it massive. Well, more or less massive. I figure the height will actually help more with placing things that are extremely high up. Eh, it looks too much like tiny. Eh... Looks like he just came out of an oven. Huh. Eh, let's go with kind of a middle ground here. That'll work. Okay, why not? That works. Alright, create a brand new survivor. Stare at the sun, which is probably bad for your health. Itch at the thing on your arm because it's not coming out anyway. Looks like something you find in one of those saw games. Key is hidden behind the stone in your chest, or your key is hidden under the stone in your arm, pried out with a rusty spoon or something. Hey children, wanna play a game? Lobotomy with a spoon. Pick up some rocks here. Let's see if we can get ourselves some basic tools. That's probably more than enough. Yeah, that's not what I need. Eh, drop those because honestly they're just ugly. Do I need ten thatch? That's what it was. And kill yourself by punching a tree. Alright, get 
ourselves a pick here and view engrams. Let's see. Let's start out. We're gonna need some fortitude. Yep. Engrams. And stone hatchet and live off berries for a bit. Let's get a spear. Keep opening up that tab button for some reason. And thatch and flint. And the thatch, let's find ourselves a big rock. More than enough flint. And I keep hitting this tab button. Why do I? I need to reassign that so I'll stop hitting that. Yeah, we get ourselves a torch when it gets nighttime. Hatchet. Torch down there because reasons. And I don't think I can do anything until I get a little bit higher. Be very, very quiet. I'm hunting animals. Okay, actually, I just ran out. Or I got everything we needed. Oop. There's a wild dodo in the bushes. You can see the wild dodo in his natural habitat. Stay hidden in the bushes here and they'll wander around quietly making cooing noises. Ah! Or I'll just murder it for its hide because I need hide to make it. There we go. Well, wow. Okay, well that got me enough hide there. Make ourselves a slingshot that I just got up here. Uh, we can see about taming one of these trikes or something in the area. Get that out of the way. Go away. We don't need you. Go away. Thank you. All those rocks we saved up from earlier here. And... Difficulty's turned all the way up, so everything can spawn at any level. Let's see if we can get this... Oh, level 28 dodo. <laughs> see if we can get rid of the dilo here. See what that trike level is. Maybe we can get the dang thing tamed. Oh, this is gonna hurt. Can't see what I'm doing. I hate the green. I'm probably gonna get killed. And killed by a Dilophosaurus. <laughs> All right, guys. Well. I'm going to get all my gear back, and of course I try to take out a 92 <laughs> Dilophosaurus. Where did we end up? Oh, wow, okay, well our gear is like 15 feet this direction then. <laughs> right after it got done eating our corpse, it wandered off. Okay. Oop. Pleasant. Well, at least we can see what level this guy is. Level four. That's actually pretty good. Um, hmm. Level sixteen. Yeah, I guess it's better than nothing. Let's see if we can get up on one of these rocks here or something. Where there's nothing immediately around here that can cause us too much of an issue. Okay. See how high up this rock we can get. Can I get up there? Come on. No! Okay, well that didn't work. Not exactly the most... Um, you know what, they're far enough away. Let's see what we can do. This is probably a really stupid idea. Yeah, really stupid idea. Really, really stupid idea. Yep. <laughs> 
I gotta really stop making stupid decisions. Get on top of a rock somewhere and. So, oh, I guess I can access this. Ooh, yay! We got ourselves boots. Got ourselves pants. We don't have our dong hanging out anymore. And I'll just leave those there just because of weight purposes. Let it decay itself. Now. That's a ways up there. That didn't work. Not even close. I forgot how short of a range this thing has. Okay. Yeah, maybe we'll just find something that's a little bit easier to hit. I swim across over here and I guess we probably tame ourselves with turtles or something. Well, we found ourselves a Dilophosaurus that chased us up a rock. Um, all I've got is three raw meat, but it's better than nothing, I guess. I'm starving to death and I really need to go get... check for some berries or something here. Oh god, more compies? Oh, scorpion. Okay. Except I don't care. Just kill it. Well, I may have just died there. <laughs> well, we got back to our body here. Um, after a scorpion ate me and then who knows what else... A level 25 Dilo that it tamed out to be, or, yeah, Dilo. For some reason, I can't ever remember the names of half of these dinosaurs. It's a little acid-spitting one. <laughs> it managed to kill whatever it was that was chasing me, uh, or that came after my body. I ended up dying from starvation while I was passed out. And while I'm blinded again, I'll just the meat under there, let him go eat the rest of it. I'm going to head back down here to the coast and see if we can knock out a turtle or something. Get a whole bunch of little animals, that way we're a little better protected. Eat some of these. Ah, there we go. Let's name him Speedy. Speedy the Turtle. Don't need seeds, don't need those. Throw the rest of the Mejo Berries, you chitin can go on there. Let's throw... Oh, let's keep the rocks, because we may need to knock something else out. Thatch out of the way, and... What do I need to fix this? Yeah, hide. Okay, level 65 turtle and a level 24 Dilophosaurus. Perfect. Well, let's head off here, see if we can find anything to get some more food going and maybe tame some more random critters. You guys follow me. Come here. I think we might just put our base right at the bottom of this. Ooh. Some more rock foundation. Let's see what we got here. I know these will. Well, that's probably an immovable one. Let's. Or unbreakable one. It's too dang big. Yeah. Let's just put it right here. Just line it up. The flat end of this. Right. Right up here. I'll move it a little bit back because I don't want the walls getting in the way if we put up walls later. I think I'm only really going to build and thatch. There we go. You probably got a level. Oh, maybe you don't. But I need to eat anyway. For those of you that don't know, if you just put it, 
put a stack of berries in your inventory bar here, and if you open up your um, inventory slot, you'll just eat them ridiculously quickly. Bunch more thatch here. I think this is at least a 3x3 three three room, just for purposes for now. We can all expand it later. Oh, we're gonna need wood. I'm so used to having like a ridiculously large um, inventory too. So usually, a, my other character on the server that I run with Lysard is we run like nearly 400 weight, like 350, I think, is what I'm at. There we go. Three down, two more to go. And then I should have a level ish, I'm hoping. I hate how this just like perfectly blends in. It's so difficult to find your door sometimes. Boop. Are you stuck down there, you dang Dilophosaurus? I hope not. I think you are. Are you? Oh, nope, nope, you're loose. See if we can get ourselves some more thatch stuff here, some more walls. We need, what, 12? 4, 8, 12, yep. You yeah, have enough for 12 walls. And then I'll be right back, guys. Well, we're back, and the Dilophosaurus just ran off over that hill chasing something, and I'm not exactly sure what it was. So, but we got the top level of our walls put up here. Speedy's still around, so at least we have something nearby the base. Though, who knows if it's a T-Rex, we'll just get eaten anyway. But next episode, I might just put the roof on this and start building out some more resources. I did get another, with that level, I did get the crates put in, so we have some storage, and we have our fire. So, I guess I'll end the episode here, and we'll pick this up when we get back. And Lord Tyson has spoken.